And I was approached by a few of my colleagues working here in a similar research area and they encouraged me to apply. So there I am, I applied and I was successful. So uh, I think I'm really lucky because this position is a very comfortable one. It's also uh, with a flagship theme of research because that's what the area of advances are. My name is Melanie Despes. I'm originally from France and I got my master's degree in mechanical engineering. So my research is focusing on resource efficiency in factories and uh, I'm adopting a view where we think that industrial systems should function the same way as nature does. So in effect we try to eliminate the concept of waste. So waste has a lot of value and we try to find ways of reusing it, whether it is within the system or elsewhere. I think the positions are uh, quite open, so there's a lot of space for us to bring our own expertise in. And also, obviously, they're on very contemporary topics, given that they are for the area of advances and uh, really focus on big themes that are relevant for society today. The area of advance at Chalmers represents themes for research and education that are considered as really big priorities for society. So, for instance, we have production, energy and transport. And I think uh, those areas of advance are also presented as a flagship for the university, so they allow us to have a lot of visibility in our research. Uh, life in uh, Göteborg is uh, very, very charming and very relaxing. Um, if I compare to all the other places that I've been before, I, I can really feel like uh, people are much more chilled and relaxed, uh, very open and tolerant. I think this is a trait Swedes are very famous for. And um, I think the city also makes a lot of efforts to give us a lot of options to have a sustainable lifestyle, whether it is about our food choices, where we can go out or transport. Um, I can really see that the city really puts efforts in giving us options so we can make a sustainable choice. So I try to implement what I do in my research also in my everyday life.